What's up, guys? It's Atlas. I'm back with another episode of Torchlight 2 Modded Madness. It's been a while, hasn't it? I, uh, had some stuff happen. But, I'm okay now. 100% better. So, let's get back into the mods. First and foremost, videos will be back on a regular-ish basis now that I am into the full swing of things. And secondly, Salon has recently said for the Sit Issues mod, that he needs a bit of help finishing the Paladin class. He posted it on his Twitter last night, and he said that he wants somebody to help him finish the Paladin, and uh, he wants the requirements to be that you are very experienced with modding Torchlight 2, you have a full, complete class to show him and prove that, like, yeah, you can do this, and also that you are willing to allow your class to be tweaked to balance the game. And you will get credit as an author for Synergies mod. I guess he just needs uh, some more help. Like, man, he's got some more stuff going on. I don't know. But he is pretty much my bread and butter of my videos. So, of course, I'm going to help him get this out. Now, let's get on to the mods we've got. Let's start with the update. Synergies, uh, fish transformations no longer drop. The Warlock and Necromancer skills have been tweaked. And DK leveling number 8 has been fixed. Combine them all has some updates too. Added the better orbs to the mod pack. Updated a few things like uh, Rainers, Thrashers. Also made Terra the uh, Transmuter, I believe. it's Yeah, Terra the Transmuter, who will be normally right here where I'm circling and in the map works. And he also is dabbling in his own vendors, but there's a bug there. If you uh, are running Combine Them All and you click on a certain vendor, in fact, if you click on Tinya. Anyone that has uh, any sort of non-combine-them-all item, like even Synergy's items, will uh, just have this big black part right here. It'll totally be blacked out. But aside from that, let's look at some other mods. We've got Death Grim Death's Grim Gate, which is also by Bandit, who does combine them all, that will uh, edit like the ways you die. You get 12 options on how you die, and you have no choice in them. It's all random, and they're a lot harsher than the normal ones. And also, we are going to look at now uh, Reckham Rising, which is a full quest line. You talk to this dude right here, who's by the tree. Also, important note, you need to have this running on top of Synergies, or he will not spawn. And then, you go to this full quest line. It is a completely fleshed out thing. It's got several dungeons in it. And a full story. I'm only going to show you a bit of this. It is level to where you will match, or the enemies will match you. Now, let's find some dudes. Like, originally it starts with just a lot of scenic pathing. I first thought this was a rehash of uh, the starting area, but it's actually a full linear path using that tile set, which I like. We're going to see how far we can go, and while we're at it, if you look at my mini-map here, you'll notice it no longer has a border. That's another mod I'm showing you right now. This is the clear mini-map by Profit. It gets rid of the border. Uh, the zoom feature still works, it's just the buttons are not visible, so you got to use your keyboard. And aside from that, it still is a circle like the minimap, which maybe will change in a bit so that they can show more in the allotted space for the minimap. And all these guys say the same thing, I think. Skeleton murder, skeleton murder. Oh, and coming up soon, now that we are getting into the... Uh, class bit of the video, I will show you a new class called the Dragonus, which uh, I'm digging because it is a polearm-centered class, which I don't see very much of or any at all. So uh, that's cool because I got a few polearms, even though they're few and far in between. And it's a fully fleshed out class. This is the guy that made it. I believe it is uh, Zeet Maniac. It is his first class. We're going to show you it in a bit, but we're going to get to the end of this area first because... Uh, Eh, for the sake of completion, let's see how far in I am. Oh yeah, I'm getting close to the end. What I love about the Theolentis is I can pretty much run through anything. Like this. See ya! But yeah, it starts with this long pathway that will lead you into the town of Lamphet, which is right here. And this is where we're going to cut it off because anything more will be spoilers into the story. Now, aside from that, I've got my usual mod lineup in the description. They are all there. And uh, let's, real quick, before we leave the video, get me killed. So we can... You get the idea. We got Death's Grim Gate. We gotta get murdered. 
So we're going to go to Orek Pass where I will get brutally murdered. Give me a bit. Best part is I can cut this all out. Alright, here we are. Darren Kuyu Hub. This is where I will get murdered. I just have to stay and there we go. Let's see what happens. Resurrect blood for the blood gods. Resurrect here, but oh my. So you don't get a choice in that. Let's actually try to fight this time. This is why we need a 105 set for the Theolentis so I don't just die. Which I actually, someone told me there is a mod that takes away the class requirements for 105 here. I'm definitely going to be looking into that. Because I die too easy. Maybe that's my crappy vitality. Oh, there I go again. Let's see it. Oh. I'll laugh so hard if I go down to level 99. Maybe I have to... Teleport around my own barriers and go in here. Let me in! Or just. Death lets you pass. Ooh, that's a different one. Ooh! So, yeah, this is cool. Oh, I actually didn't mean to do that. Death finds you lacking. Resurrect the area entrance. I want to see what's in that door, but I keep getting murdered because of my crap vitality and bad gear. Oh, and there's... The, oh, that guy. You know what? Let's GTFO. Is that portal still there? Oh, it's not. Wait, oh, that's what happened. I have to kill the genie, or the genie, and then I get it. He's the gatekeeper. But I don't want to deal right now. Alright, so I feel that's an adequate demonstration of the Deathsgrim Gate. I have lost enough gold as it is. So thank you very much for joining me. My name is Atlas. All the mods are in the description below. If you like this video, go ahead and like it because it really does make my day and help. And if you want to see more videos like this with Torchlight 2 and maybe some other content when I feel like a game is worthy and I have something that I can actually contribute to it because I like to contribute, go ahead and subscribe. You will not regret it. Thank you, promise. Now, happy modding Torchlight 2 users.